Hello, Tom from Every Step Calculus, Every Step Physics.com. I'm going to do a problem in uh, calculus, U substitution, and we're going to do a function with cosine in it. Index 8 to get to my menu. Press enter. I'm already at use substitution, but you'd scroll with this cursor here, down or up or whatever, to get to the subject that you're intended to get to for the problem that you're at hand. So use substitution is this problem. And we're going to enter the function. We have to press alpha first before you enter anything in these entry lines here. So we're going to press alpha and then we want cosine second z here which is cosine and then second x which is log of x close off the parentheses and divided by x is the function so I will show you what you've entered you can change it if you want I s say it's okay And notice that the trick to use substitution is that what's ever inside the parentheses here, you take the derivative of that, and you've got to have to be, it's got to be able to be matched to the outside somehow, okay? So we're going to rewrite this because here we have 1 over x here, dx, so we're going to kind of isolate that so it's really clear for you. And then u is equal to log of x, and du is equal to 1 over x. Uh, you have to memorize that. The integral of 1 over x is log of x, etc. So the opposite derivative of log of x is 1 over x, OK? And so now we're going to do the integral of cosine of u, du, equals sine of u plus c. When you do the integral of cosine cosine of u is sine of u. So now we have the answer of sine of log of x plus c. That's the answer. Okay. Now we're going to do we're going to do an, another problem here, and we're going to press alpha. And we're going to have second cosine of second log of x. And without the x divided by x, without that, okay? Show you what you've entered. Say it's okay. I notice this is not a u substitution problem, but an integration by parts problem, okay? Because notice that the derivative of what's inside the parentheses here, log of x equals to 1 over x, but there's nothing on the outside that equals 1 over x. So if that's the case, then you cannot integrate it by u substitution. You have to go to integration by parts. And that's this pathetic, really long, long system here of getting the answer. More Sudoku of math. <laughs> So we have cosine of log of x, du equals minus sine of log of x. You know that, didn't you? And then we start out with the derivative of v is equal to 1. So then we're going to we're going to integrate 1, and we come up with v is equal to x, OK? Now here's the formula, u times v minus the integral of v times du in integration by parts. So we're going to put that together. Here's u and here's v times v minus the integral of v and then du here with respect to dx <coughs> and notice this x cancels this one so we have the minus the integral of minus sine of log of x and then we we, we um, do the mathematics of minus two minus sines and get plus cosine of log of x times x plus the integral of sine of log of x dx, okay? 
now we still got this problem here we have to integrate again okay within the first problem so we're going to do that du of we're going to make u sine of log of x and du is equal cosine of log of x divided by x and dv equals 1 and then v is equal to the integral of 1 dx and so v is equal to x again we put the formula I remind you of the formula again we put that together here's u and here's v and here's v here this x here is v and then we have the du which is cosine of log of x divided by x okay again the x's cancel we get integral of cosine of log of x this part here okay so now we c go back to the beginning we're trying to find the integral of cosine of log of x with respect to x and that equals cosine of log of x plus sine of log of x plus x times x notice we're putting that first part together here with the second part that we found with second integration and then we have this here minus the integral of cosine of log of x well that's the same as this okay so we're going to dump that to the left side and make two two of them two times the integral of cosine of log of x equals cosine of log of x times x and plus sine of log of x plus times x okay and then we're going to take the two and divide it put it on the other side through algebra and here's the answer cosine log of x times x divided by 2 and sine of log of x times x divided by 2 plus c isn't that wonderful because the notice the answer is harder than the than the original problem that's why calculus in my estimation solves nothing it's in reality you know it's just a bunch of games that mathematicians got together and played and had a good time with and I say that after 25 years of studying this stuff you know it's a bunch of baloney all right um, go to my site buy my programs and pass calculus it's easy when you get my programs so think about that okay uh, have a good one.